Okay, sit here. We'll wait till people come in. We did a testing. So let's see. All right. Hey guys, Mitz. Mitz, first one in. <laughs> Hi, Patty, Bissa, Bethany, Erica. Linda, oh, baby, you can't get, I know you want those treats. You're going to have to wait. I already gave you one. <laughs> oh, my gosh. No. <laughs> uh, oh, my gosh. <laughs> uh, let's see. Darla, Molly, Cheryl, Karina, Bethany. Uh, Nashua, Sarah Moonlit Crafter. I'm trying to catch everybody as you come in. Hi, Janet. Good morning. And thank you for my, thank you for my double, <laughs> my double gift. Janet gave me this for my birthday. I haven't opened it yet because I don't need to because I still have some left in the other jar. And, uh, <laughs> I don't know if I need to just turn off the auto light. Tell me if it starts flickering in and out and I'll turn off the auto light. Correct. So you can tell me what it looks like. Uh, hi, G. So Linda, Masaki, or Masiki. I'm not sure I'm saying it right. Barb Chicken Pot Pie Society. Hi, Jane. Pamela, Beth. So if you don't know um, the, the deal, I come on a little early to say good morning to everybody. Say good morning to everybody here. And um, yeah, I come on every Monday and Wednesday, 9 a.m. Eastern. But I usually come on about 30 minutes early to say good morning to everybody. Hi, Candace, Lori, Lynette, Ashley Colors. Yep, it's a Moogle Monday. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> or as um, Julie Topaz, Marvelous Monday. Either one. Hi, Terry. Uh, Twyla. Uh, I'm probably, I think I said hi to Lori. I know I'm probably missing people coming in. <clears throat> I got tons to show you guys today. I got birthday gifts. I got books. I got magazines. I got more um, of my... Um, Amour Fabrics in. Uh, I got uh, markers and pencils from Zandra and tons of art cards to show you guys. I gotta get my voice going here. I got coffee and juice. Well, I'm gonna start out by saying this. <coughs> Sorry, I went down the wrong hole. I swallowed the juice. <clears throat> Lady True North Jan sent the cats these fish these fish catnips and they have been <clears throat> just I mean will not stay off my desk so I finally gave them one there was four in the pack I finally gave them one and they still want to get up here and get these so I'm gonna have to go put those away shortly <laughs> after I show them uh, so thanks thanks lady true north jan for thinking of the cats Oh my gosh, they are going crazy for that cat. And I gave them one, but it's like, that doesn't matter. We want the ones on your desk. <laughs> we want the ones on your desk. Hi, Bacola. How you doing? How was your weekend? Happy Moogle Marvelous Monday. <laughs> Hi, Trisha. Good to see you. Everybody else coming in. Thanks, everybody, for popping in. Um, yeah, so we went up and uh, Denise had a little cake for me on Saturday. And then we went to Barnes & Noble, of course. And um, then I've, of course, got things that I've ordered and uh, got the newest uh, Catherine Anderson book. 
some new magazines. I got this book. I have this propped up so that there's not a glare, but there's still a glare. Um, I, I had um, got this uh, a Kickstarter that was going on for uh, Will Terry. Some of y'all may know Will Terry. He's been around, has had classes, and just he's been on the internet forever. Anyway, he um, he put out this book, What They Don't Teach You at Art School, and they and he used his own. He does a lot of, he does digital art, but it's just I wanted to support him and everything he says I really enjoy. So uh, I got that to show. Uh, I pulled this out here to put in the tops from my Annie sent me a whole bunch of washi tape. So I'm going to pull these stickers off the top and put them in my one of my um, uh, travelers books here. And then I got some different books I'm reading. Zandra sent me. Xandra sent me uh, the Crayola World of Colors markers and pencils. If we have time, we'll test those today. Just so much stuff. Hi, Candy, Lori, Julia. Hi, Julie. Good morning. Happy Marvelous Monday. Little Gypsy said hi to Candy. I know people are coming in. I'm not trying to miss anybody, but I look away and the chat's completely changed, right? So thanks to everybody that's here. Thanks to the lurkers. Thanks to everybody that's, that uh, gave me gifts last week and supported the channel. I will be sending out thank yous for that. I send out thank yous the first week of the month. So, you know, the first week of March, I'll be, and everybody's been requesting that I make a print of this. So let me go ahead and show you last week, and I did varnish these. So last week I did some of the collage fodder. Um, I made some uh, collage uh, collages from the fodder that you guys sent me. So this one you saw me do, this was Donna Siebel, and I did post it. So I did varnish it, so you can see the varnish. And um, so I did this one. I still have to paint the backs. I still have to paint the backs black. I don't paint the backs of my collages or my art cards or any of that till after I varnish it. Because the varnish, if it gets on the back of a black matte paint, will leave shiny marks, right? I did, Bethany. It was awesome. And uh, so anyway, I um, I don't paint the backs till after the varnish is dry. So I did varnish this over the weekend. Oh, thank you, Bissa, for the $5 super chat. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you so much. Let me write you down. I did put everybody in my book over the weekend. So I'll add you to it. Thank you so much. And uh, I appreciate everybody that supports the channel. I do send out thank you. So I've been, everybody's requesting me to make a print of this for a thank you. So maybe I'll do that for um, the, the, to send out thank yous to the people that support the channel. And then um, this one, Becky Kalura, I did finish this one. I did and varnished it. So um, I had signed this one with a gold gel pen and the gold gel pen did not hold up under the varnish. So I'll sign it on the back. But um, yeah, so you got to be careful when you varnish anything that'll move, anything that's water soluble. And a gel pen, gel pens can be, I don't know that they all are, but gel pens can move with water or, you know, varnish. So, um, you know, everything else on here is acrylic paint or a Posca or something that's waterproof. But I had signed it in jelly uh, jelly roll and that's not waterproof. So this one is the one I did for uh, Becky Kalora. Now I'm gonna show, I'll go ahead and show you this. And I'll end up showing you again. They both requested, they said, I'll pay you if you'll use the other half. <laughs> If you'll use the other parts, because I because they sent me plenty, right? They sent me tons of collage fodder to um to do them. Well, I had enough left over for both of them to do a second one. So here's the one that I'm working on for Becky. And I just got it laid out. They're just laid out, no paint or anything yet. So this is the one I'm working on for Becky with the other parts of her collage fodder, except for the watch. I had the watch at the end of the bridge there. And it's just laid out. See, nothing's just, it's just tacked down with a glue stick for now. So this is the other one that I'm going to do. And again, you know, I'm going to try to know how long I got some commissions I got to get done first. But uh, I got that. And then um, the one that I did for Donna, this one, she had leftovers. So this is what I've got done, uh, laid out again. I got this laid out from um, 
the leftovers of Donna's. And the little dog she sent me, the little dogs are going to go in the Fibs book. So, because she also sent some little dogs. She sent all this. She sent all this stuff. So, uh, obviously, uh, there's enough for three three collages, but I'm only going to do these two. Okay, I've got to tape up this cord. It's hanging down. Hang on. I have a piece of tape up here for the cord on my camera. It's hanging down. There we go. So anyway, again, I just have it tacked down. Hang on, fam. Let me just see if I can turn this down. Families are uh, messaging each other. Let me. I might have to move my phone out of here. Um, so yeah. So I'm. I'm gonna do this one for, for Donna. So okay. Let me take my. Hang on, guys. I gotta take my phone out of here. That's not gonna stop. I turned down the volume, but it's still dings when I get messy. I'm on group family group chat things, you know. So every time someone messages each other, I get dinged as well, which doesn't bother me except when I'm streaming. So anyway, I'm going to finish that, and I might make the print out of this one. And uh, so that's those. I probably will show them again in a little while. So that's the collage stuff I've been working on. Um, just lots of stuff. We've been working lots of stuff. Okay, Elmeris. Uh, who else am I missing? Candy, Sylvie, Holly D, Lori. Um, so, uh, Lori, you can find them in books, magazines, calendars. You can find them everywhere. Um, there's interesting stuff. And it depends on what you think is interesting. I think it's all interesting because it's how you put it together. It's how you put it together. Hi, Nancy. Um, okay, get your tea, Pacola. Hi, Sylvie. Hi, Lady True North Jan, who sent the cats these things that they will not leave alone. I finally had to bust it open, Lady Jan, and give them one. So Lady Jan sent the cats these, <laughs> these catnip fish, and they will not stay off my desk. I am serious. I finally had to, hi, some big jerk. I finally had to open it up and give them one, because there was four in the pack. So I finally gave them one, but they still want the ones on my desk. <laughs> so <laughs> anyway, thank you. Thank you from the cats, Lady Jan. They are seriously uh, loving that. Seriously loving it. <laughs> uh, uh, let's see. Um, well, that's the name of my show, Julia, is Coffee and Art in the Morning. Although I usually have coffee and cranberry juice. So I have something to keep, because, you know, I'm talking for three and a half, at least three and a half hours, right? So I got to have stuff to keep keep my voice going. Let's see, Marie, Michelle. <laughs> I know, right, Lady J? It was, they're so cute. They love it. They love them. <laughs> Hi, Annie Mame. How you doing? You check out those fish for your kitty. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, Lady Lady Jan sent those. Uh, oh, you like tea. Okay, tea for you. Okay, gotcha. Well, that's Pacola, too. So, um, let's see here. Uh, yeah, I have that, too. Annie, my daughter in L.A., she sent me, well, she sent the cats. Okay. Ah! Uh! Hang on, guys. I did something to the camera. What did I do? Hang on. Can you hear me? Hang on, guys. I did something to my camera mic. Hang on. I don't know if you can hear me. And the camera move and disconnected me. Hang on. Let's see if I can get this going again. <laughs> I don't know what I did. Hang on. Let me tape that back up. All right. Hang on, guys. Can you hear, you hear me but can't see? Okay, I don't know why. It says my camera should be on. Ay, 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 ay. Okay. I might have to leave and come back. Um,
Okay, are we back? <laughs> I don't know what I hit or if the, if the button hit. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> are we back? <laughs> uh, are we back? Okay, we're back. Okay, so hang on. Let me uh, let me fix my uh, settings back again. Let's see. We're kind of zoomed in. I think we're okay. <laughs> no, it wasn't the cat. Oh, oh, sorry, Michelle. Let's see. Okay, I'm back. Okay, thanks, guys. Now the cord dropped off the back of because I have it taped to the back of my computer here, and it dropped. And it disconnected me. I don't know why it would do that, but we're back, I think. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Let's turn up the brightness just a little there. I think that's good. Turn off the autofocus. Okay. All right. Audio sounds like you're inside of a cardboard box. Okay, so maybe my mic is not working. I don't know. Does it does the mic sound different, Janet? Does the mic sound different? Do I need to fix that too? Let's see here. Audio. Oh, okay, it did. Hang on, let me go back to where's my blue snow. Okay, there we go. All right. All right, so that should be better. I changed the mic. Okay. I changed the mic. Is that better, uh, some big jerk? I put it back on my. Uh, it, it it defaulted. It defaulted to my camera, and it should be on my snowball. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it defaulted back when I left. Sorry, guys. It's Monday. It's a Mughal Monday. <laughs> All right. So I think we're good now. <laughs> I think we're good. Thanks, guys. All right. So um, I'm not sure where to start. We, we need to start kind of soon because I got so much to show. So much show and tell. Um, and the, let's move that because that has a, the ring lights right there. Can't put anything shiny right there. Let's see. Maybe I move it over this way just a little. Let's move the camera over just a little. There we go. Okay. <laughs> okay. So let's see, where do I start? Let me move some of the stuff out of the way. Uh, again, I got this Will Terry um, Kickstarter book. I think it was Kickstarter. No, it wasn't Indiegogo. I think it was Kickstarter. <laughs> It was either Kickstarter or Indiegogo. I don't remember now. Um, what they don't teach you in art school. So I'm going to show that. I got some new magazines. I always get this uh, juxtapo ju juxtapose art magazine whenever it comes out. I got this Origin. I like this for, um, I like cutting the little bits of this out of, um, now this is the same magazine. It's, it flips to reverse. So half of it goes one way. And then you flip it over to go the other. But they're so inexpensive. I always buy two. Um, I always buy two of these so I can, you know, have plenty to cut up on both sides. Because you, you see something pretty on one side and you want the other side. So they're so, I don't do that with any other magazine but the Origin because they are inexpensive. So I get, um, I get the two because they are reversible and they have two covers. So I got those to show today. Um this book then at uh, Barnes and Noble I got these two books for my birthday this is a cozy mystery okay did I know let's get the light going here hang on guys it got a little dark down here I think I need to maybe zoom in let's see let's zoom in one there we go let's brighten that up there we go that's better so I got um this is a cozy mystery. I have not read any of her books. I think this is her fourth one. But usually these kind of books, you don't have to read in order. Uh, these little cozy mysteries, you don't have to read them in order. But I try to buy them when they're in hardback because by the time they go to the little paperbacks, I can't hardly see them. They're too tiny. The, the font is too tiny to read. When they by the time they go in paperback, so if I buy any of these mysteries like this, I have to get them in um, the hardback so that they're big enough. You like cozy mysteries, Molly? Yeah, I don't read them all that often, but every now and then one just grabs me, especially if it has to do with the bookstore or you know, 
you know, I sent one to Pecola on the tea shop. There's a tea shop series by a different, uh, different author. So I've never read any Ellery Adams um, cozy mystery. So I picked that up for uh, my birthday because uh, I got some birthday money um, for Barnes and Noble. So um, did Ellery be married? <laughs> some big jerk. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so I know. So that's uh that's one. That's one that I got. Then the other one I got, this was on clearance. It was normally, I think it went down to 15, then it went down to 10. But I love these Tashkin, Tashins. I'm not sure how you say it, but Tashin books. I have tons of them. Some I've ordered off of Amazon. Some I get at the bookstore. But the medieval and renaissance art. So, um, yeah. I mean, look, look at some of this. It's just these tapestries. And so, yeah. So I got this one for my birthday. There's just so much in it. And of course it has a description of what each thing is. It's probably just things out of museums that they put together. So anyway, so I got that. Then let me move that, um, that thrift books. I got this butterflies and moths. And uh, again, it's uh, it's a used book, thrift books. And um, so I got this. All different butterflies and moths. Uh, have you ever read Mr. Pember's 24-hour bookshop? Um, I don't think so, Bethany. Let me write that down. No, that sounds like something I would like. Let me write that down. Mr. I mean, I, I sounds familiar. I probably read like at least the you know an excerpt or something 24 hour but that sounds like well that sounds like what i like <laughs> thank you i wrote it down i wrote it down i like a cozy mystery every now and then um i don't know erica i don't know if i will use that for collage or the the <laughs> the medieval book i don't know if i'll use it for collage or not and the butterfly book I did get. Yeah, that, I, I did. Yeah, see, Janet knows. Janet knows. <laughs> That's why I got the butterfly book. Uh, let's see. Hi, Arlene. Arlene, make sure you send me your address so I can send you some art cards or a print. Miss Arlene, I know you have my email because you've emailed me. So <laughs> send me your address, Arlene, so I can send you a thank you. You are at everybody's stream so helpful there's so, a few of you that i just want to thank you just for being you know at everybody's streams and arlene is one of those okay so uh, we're gonna flip through this again janet got me janet got me this for my birthday so she figured out it takes me uh, it, i use two jars in a year so <laughs> my birthday <laughs> She sends me two jars, so this should last me till uh, for a year, because that's how much I use this stuff. I'm telling you, people, you don't know how much I use my golden matte medium, and it comes really wrapped up well. Um, she ordered off of Amazon. It came from um, what was the, the the art supply store? It came from now, not Blick. Uh, what's the other one? The other big one? Jer not Jerry's Artorama. There's another one. Anyway, it came from a it came from one of the art uh, art stores <clears throat> via through uh, through Amazon. Okay, so let's see. I know, right? I agree. I agree, Jean. She does not sleep. <laughs> Hi, Mindy, Bethany. Uh, let's see who else am I missing? I'm sure I'm missing. Hi, Kalora. How you doing? Yeah, we're good. For <laughs> Becky, we're good for another year of streaming. And speaking of, uh, speaking, of, no, it wasn't cheap Joe's either, Candy. But that's a good guess. Um, I don't remember. I I got rid of the box. So yeah. Hi, Gina. So Becky Kalora, you know, I finished your collage. I don't, you just came in, so you probably didn't see it. So I did finish your. Uh, look, I finished your collage and varnished it. So I just have to paint the back black and sign it because, as I said earlier, the uh, I used a gold gel pen and the gold gel pen smeared off. 
Um, so, and then I put together a second one for you that this is just laid out. So I haven't done anything to it except lay it out with the, some more of your collage fodder. So I'm going to finish this one. So um, hi, hi, Selena. And I got, I got fabric here from Selena Plus. Um, Selena has a deal of the day. I think, is it still going on, Selena? Um, so anyway, Cora, I got, I'm going to finish this one for you. And then you'll have these two. And then, like I said earlier, I did the second one. I did a second one for Donna. Now, I cannot do, if you guys, if you send me 50 pieces of collage fodder, I cannot do two for each of you. I'm just going to tell you right now. I just cannot do two for each of you. But um, anyway, so this is the second one that I'm working on Donna with the with the extra stuff she sent. So I'm, I'm going to work on those probably... We'll probably do that Wednesday. I think today we're going to be filled up showing uh, art cards. I've got a bucket, a literally a bucket of collage. Uh, <laughs> I mean, of uh, of art cards for the that are due on the twenty fourth. They're due on the twenty fourth. It was Jerry's. It was Jerry's. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Okay, thanks, Janet. I couldn't remember. So they came from Jerry's. Uh, Jerry's Artorama. So let me see. Did um. I don't know if, uh, let's see. Okay, so um, uh, Selena is at the vet. I don't know if she saw, Did is your, uh, I missed it probably. Are you? Do you still have your deal of the day going on? So if you go to Amor Fabrics, Selena, she on YouTube, she has a, uh, and she'll have a link to her um, Etsy shop, but uh, she got, She's doing a deal of the day. I think she started it yesterday, the day before. So I jumped on that deal of the day where she has a bunch of trim, all kinds of trims that she bought. And uh, and if you get her deals of the day, she doesn't have one every day. That, that sounds like she has a deal every day. She doesn't have a deal every day. But when she has a deal, she calls it a deal of the day. And she posts a video right there on her channel. She posts a video. So if you want to get... Um, you're welcome, Kalora. So if you want to get, um, if you, whoops, let's see where, uh, it goes so fast. Okay, she's already gone off there. Okay, so um, go to um, Amor Fabrics, and I'm going to go ahead and, and I'll show you that here in a minute. I This is one of the orders that I got from her, came in a couple days ago. And then I also got this off of Amazon for uh, my birthday money. My uh, my family all sent me different um, Amazon gift cards. So, oh, thanks, Bacola. There you go. There's her Etsy shop. It's the same name. Same name on Etsy, YouTube, Amore Fabrics, right there. Thank you, Bacola. So, um, no, but I can set up another one for your ladies. Oh, okay. All right. She said that it, it ended. Uh, so if you want, uh, if you, yeah, let her, let her know if you like her. Um, the, it is an Etsy. I mean, she does have the, uh, she does have the, the trims in her Etsy. Okay. Okay. So then I got, and I'm going to show that here in just a minute. So then I got this. Um, I know I have, I don't know that I have every Catherine Anderson book. She has probably 20 books. I don't know exactly, maybe 15. She has a lot of collage books. And this was her vintage imagery, uh, vintage journal imagery two. And um, so I got this one and uh, cause I love, I love Catherine Anderson's book. So this has a lot of people. And then on the back side, she has marbleized papers on the back of each one. So you could use either one. You can use the people or you could use the marbleized uh, papers. Like they look like in papers that are in old books, you know? So isn't it beautiful guys? Look at those. Look how beautiful those are. I mean, the images are cool too, but I love, and there's some butterflies. I love the marble papers. Look at that one love the colors in that one so i'll use it in my collage and my art journal there's a few animals and butterflies and things and some old letters but it's mostly people in this one so um yeah so that's katherine and and there's some butterflies on the back so that's katherine anderson katherine oh no 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 get up all right i'm gonna have to go on out of here now they want these 
They want those fish, and I already gave them one. Oh my gosh, I can't stay away from the catnip. <laughs> oh my gosh. So anyway, um, uh, I love Katherine Anderson's collage book. So this is on, on Amazon as well. Okay, so let's see. I'm making stacks here. Then the magazines that I got, again, I showed uh, I showed the origin has a double, it's double-sided, but it's the same one. It's just reversed. So half the magazine, you go this way, and then you get to the middle, and you flip it, and you go the second half this way. But um, <laughs> these magazines have such nice little things. Hi, Kathy Bird. Hi, Juanita. I know I'm missing Lynette Porter. I know I'm probably missing... Um, Yes, she does, Arlene. I know. I love it. I'm going to show the stuff I got here. I'm trying to get through the books. Uh, I'll, I'll wait on this one because I want to kind of uh, take a little more time on this. But I want to show you guys everything I got. Then we can show more if you want to see something more in more detail. Okay. All right. So I'm going to just kind of do a little flip through this because what I love about these are they have different art and artists that they feature. And there's just so much little things that you can use in your art journaling. Uh, you know, if you want, and they have, she has quotes in here. Amateur sit, amateurs sit and wait for inspiration. The rest of us just get up and go to work. And I always tell y'all, you know, 99 of percent of inspiration is in your butt. You sit down, you pick up your pens, your pencils and your paint and you start. If you don't feel inspired, just start. Um, let's see. Um, oh, OK. Thanks. Uh, thanks, Abigail. Abigail's in the Netherlands. She says she's bought the digital version because she's in the Netherlands. So obviously it's going to be cheaper. And the magazine's only five ninety nine. Which are five ninety five, dollars which I think is a good price for a magazine these days. But if you're international, what you're going to be paying for is the shipping, right? I think that's why Flow is not going to be in the U.S. anymore. Flow magazines, uh, I think they're only going to be uh, in Europe now. I think that's what I saw, read, heard. or so. All right, so now let's flip it around the other side. So here is uh, another quote. So they have different quotes. And again, now I'm going to go the other way. You know, I mean, I'm going, to, I'm flipping the same way, but I flipped the magazine over. So there's just so much little inspiration, color combinations. Look at this. I like this quote too. You don't need to rebuild a relationship with everyone you have forgiven. So I like that. And look, look how pretty these are. And they have the, the artist and everything. So if you want to look them up on, um, if you want to look them up on Instagram or, you know, or if they reference a website, but the, it's, they're just so eye candy. There's so much eye candy and color combinations. That's what I love about this one. Um, oh, okay. So here you go, guys. She just added 10 more daily deals in her shop. So if any of you want to grab one of her daily deals, um, I'll let you leave the channel and go over there. <laughs> But I'm getting ready to show her fabric, so you might want to stay a minute. <laughs> okay, so uh, again, it's this is the same magazine. So if you see it in the store, either one of these are the same magazine. Okay, they just have two covers. They have two covers, but this is the um, this is the uh, Miranda Pleasant's Origin Vegan Recipes, Home and Wellness, uh, Artful Living. Um, self care and all just it's just beautiful. They're just the art in it is just beautiful. So that's the origin magazine. Then the juxtapose art and culture. Now I'm gonna have to be careful flipping through this. You know, this this channel is not made for kids, but we have a family friendly channel. So I try not to show any art that has nudity or anything like that. But uh, again, I'm just gonna quickly flip. It's pop, it's a pop culture. It's a pop culture art magazine, and I love it. I love the I love the magazine, but I got to be careful, um, you know, uh, flipping through it. Just saying, you know. And if if you go to buy it, say, and that's true of any art magazine. I have nothing against nudity in art, but I'm just not showing it on on my YouTube channel because I want it to be a family friendly 
non not made for kids, but a family friendly. Got to do so many explanations anymore. Jeez. Anyway, juxtapose. Um, I get this every month at, at, that I see it as well. Okay, then um, Annie. Well, let me let me wait on the washi tapes. I'll wait on the washi tapes so I can show because. Uh, uh, Selena's at the vet. So let me show her fabrics here. So she it did come in this little bag and she sent me a pin with a refill, a teal pin with a refill. Don't forget, guys, to put it in caps uh, if you're talking to me. I'm sure I'm missing things. Um, let's see. Did Devin? Hi, Devin. Nichols. I know I'm missing people coming in. So thanks everybody. So she included, she always includes some little something. So she sent this little pin. And uh, so let me show you what I got in this set here. I don't ever remember. And I, I ordered again. <laughs> I don't remember what I order, but I, everything I order, I love when it gets here. So I did place another order either yesterday or Saturday. I can't remember. Um, so I am making, and y'all saw, let me show you the one. I already sent, uh, Xandra hers and she already got it. So I can't show you Xandra's, but I'm making these little prayer pouches. So here's the one, this one I made for myself. This is my sample one. And I put a charm on it. Um, the one I made for Xandra has a little mermaid charm on it. And it has a little pouch for a little prayer and it's on a, this one is not on a, a, a stretchy cord, but the rest of them I made are on stretchy cord. And then um, I put a little trim on this, but these are, these are the fabrics that I've bought from Selena. Okay. So I bought these from Selena and then I sent the one to Zandra and then I made this one. Let me put it on black background. I made this one for Jonna, sister woman, Jonna. And they're just different shapes. Some are square, some are more oblong, but I put a little camper on her. She has one of these campers. Um, thank you, guys. Thank you. Um, so anyway, and I added some little tassels here, and I added this little flower. This is a flower trim, and I added one on the back, too. And then um, I added this little charm for uh, Jonna because she has one of these. And if you don't follow Jonna, uh, cr preppy crafty girl she did put up some more kits some more paper kits vintage paper kits on her etsy so if you like the paper go to preppy crafty girl for vintage paper if you like fabrics go to selena's um go to selena's uh uh there she is amor, amor fabrics okay for the for the uh this is where i got these fabrics so um, I made this one for Jonna. So I'll send that out to her tomorrow when I go to the post office. Okay, so let me show you what I ordered. This, this, is, this is the last order I had, and I have another one coming in. So I bought some silks and some more of the... They're just all beautiful. I'm not sure where she gets. I guess they're mostly from India, but I, you know, I can't say where she got every fabric. And maybe it's her secret. Oh, there's Jonna. Thank you, Pacola. There's Jonna's Etsy shop for vintage paper, vintage paper kits. Um, there, go to Preppy Crafty Girl. And she also has a YouTube channel where she goes through her kits as well, just like um, Selena does her fabrics. Uh, uh, Jonna does her paper kits and she shows them flip throughs on her channel as well. Okay, so let's see. I know I'm missing people coming in. Um, hey, it's Trey. <laughs> Good morning. That's cute. All right, so I'm going to show you all the different fabrics. I'm just going to flip through them real quick. And so you get like a square of these. And you just have to go look. She has so much stuff, guys. You just got to go look. You just got to go look at them. Okay. But I just want, they're all folded in half. So I think I'll just leave them folded in half. But this is half the size, right? So this is half of the size here. But look how beautiful they are. Okay. <clears throat> so just so you can see, they're all, there's such a variety. She has such a variety. Look at this. <clears throat> So this is one of the kits or one of the packs, if you want to call it kit, pack. Uh, this is one of them. This was all in one. 
so aren't they beautiful just loved it and again i'm just showing you the half so that's uh because they're they're thin they're trans translucent <clears throat> aren't they so pretty all right so that's one and i have another place that i keep them but i'll just keep them in here i kept them in the bags to show you guys so everybody got to see them as they came okay then this one and these are little squares like these are the kind of the size that i make the prayer pouches out of and then i got these that i can line them and back them with so and i got some of the other fabrics dude i got more coming i ordered a whole nother a whole nother i think four more packs because <laughs> i just love them oh so yeah so i just want to show them to you here aren't they aren't they just stunning guys they're just they're just beautiful <clears throat> I can't imagine how long it takes you, Selena, to, you know, cut up and cut down and process all these fabrics that you buy. Look at this one. I know. Aren't they beautiful? I know they are. <laughs> Janet's asking, asking Dev. She's untraumatized. Yeah, Janet and I, if y'all missed it, Janet and I had Devin on as a guest last Thursday uh, on our guest show <laughs> that we do every you know few months. But anyway, Devin was our guest uh, on last Thursday show. So if y'all didn't watch that, um, go back and watch if you want to meet Devin and see Devin's. Devin has stunning art journals and tons of them. She does a lot of art journals, uh, so they're really they're really nice. So go over there and look at uh, look at Devin's work, and she has a YouTube channel as well. This one's kind. Of, let me put something behind this one so you can see how blue how blue that is. They're so translucent, so beautiful. They're just, just stunning. Look at these. I know, right? I know. Just the quality of what it went into making the fabrics themselves. So I wanted to share them with you guys. And um, because I really do like Selena's shop. Look at this one. I love this one. Look at that light teal color. I don't know if you can see. It's a light teal. <laughs> you sound like Janet, Arlene. I know. Yeah, you sound like Janet. Oh, my gosh. I love space. Although Janet has space, but I think she's just, uh, she's uh, very, um, she gets uh emotional if she doesn't have a place for everything <laughs> look how beautiful though <laughs> and then this one this has all these little like pearly pearl like pearl colored uh, beads on it so there's that one okay and then this one Didn't y'all didn't y'all enjoy that we're here that went over and uh, hung out when uh, Devin was on our show? Yeah, it was it was fun. Thank you so much for doing that, Devin. And these are like silk. I'm thinking they're silk, and they're nice big. Look, just look how how flowy. <clears throat> so, and they're all these squares. I know, aren't they gorgeous, Devin? They are all gorgeous. They're all so different. You wouldn't think there'd be so much variety. I know, Julia. Devin was amazing, wasn't she? It was good. It was good. 
Janet, you are not traumatized by everything. Oh, yeah, they are gorgeous. <laughs> Janet, you're so funny. Oh. So I just want to flip through them. Are they pretty guys? Aren't y'all enjoying seeing them? <laughs> I, know, I like seeing them again. Paisley and it's a green, it's a green paisley. <laughs> Aren't they nice? So there you go. So that was the other kit of silks. Dance the seven veils. Well, I won't be dancing the seven veils. You can dance the seven veils, Julia. <laughs> so there we go. So let me put this in my fabric bag. I mean, my fabric tote. Get in my pen here and the paper there. So I save the bags. Take a sip of juice. <sighs> okay. Next. And I, I want to test these out today too. We're gonna to get to uh, we're gonna to get to all the art cards because I got tons of art cards. Let me see here. Let me let me get the camera. It's like the light wants to. There we go. Come on, light. You can stay. You can stay there. <laughs> so Zandra sent me this card. She made this uh, um, mermaid card. It's a mermaid because see, there's the tail. You know, Zandra's our mermaid. So she sent me a really nice card, and she sent me these Crayola, this is another card, goes over there. She sent me the Crayola Color the World color pencil. She'd already sent me the Crayola uh, crayons of the color of colors of the world, and I have never seen either one of these in my Michaels. Or Hobby Lobby. Not saying they don't have them, but I have not seen these. So we want to test these. Hopefully we can do it today. If we don't do it today, I'll try to do it on Wednesday. But there's 24 colors. Let me open it up here. 24 markers. And y'all know, they're like the super tips. Y'all know I love me my super tips. So they come in these little individuals which they won't be staying in these boxes. Just saying, I don't, if, if I kept things in boxes like this, I would not use them. So I do like that they come in there, but <laughs> they're not staying in these boxes. I'll have to find something else to do. You know, maybe make, uh, cover them and make them, you know, remember I showed my, how an artist cooks and I, I did, I made a, I actually made a box like this. I cut it down, made it myself for my cards to fit in. So maybe this could be like just to hold uh, some of my art cards or something and uh, cover it because, yeah, I love the way that they package them, but I won't use them. My, look, this is where my markers go. <laughs> this is where my paint, my markers, my pens, this is where it all goes right here in front of me. They don't stay in boxes. If I keep them in boxes, they won't get used. Um, oh, all right. So G says she found them at Walmart. Okay. So that's good to know. So if y'all are looking for them. Yeah, they're all skin colors. It's a whole, all the skin tones. Okay. So let's open the next one. Okay, and I don't know. I guess there might be some duplicates. Um, but the, every box, this one didn't have that one. So there may be different ones. Okay, so hang on. I'm going to take them all 24 out. I'll put them back in here for now. But I want to show them to you and maybe do some testing. We'll see how much time we have. Right? So, again, isn't this awesome? I <laughs> just love them. Thank you so much, Sandra. It's going to be so fun. You know, because y'all know I love my um, I love my super tips, Crayola super tips. These are awesome. The other nice thing about these is you can do watercolor with them. Okay, like let me see if I can find. Ouch! I want something to. Uh, here we go. Let's do it. Mm. Hang on. So you can take um, you can do it on a piece of plastic too. 
just a piece of plastic from uh, from packaging, you know, clear packaging. You could do it with that too. Let me move my birthday cards up here. So what you can do now, I got to get a piece of paper. <clears throat> and I need a water brush. <laughs> Uh, let's see, where do you get one that's got some water in it? So what you can do with these, and this is true of any of the super tips, any of the markers, you can put the, put it down on a, um, on a non-porous surface, a craft, you know, you really need to be white so you can see the color. Uh, anything watercolor, you really need it to be on white. Uh, if you don't have a porcelain tray or something, then get a piece of plastic. Like here we go. Okay, so this is this is just a piece of plastic, but it's got a it's got a unicorn. It's got a zippy the unicorn on it. But you can put the plastic on top of a piece of white paper and do the same thing. Okay, as long as it's a non-porous surface, right? Okay. Um, but I have this, so I'm going to use it. So you can do that, and then you can do like a watercolor. Mm -mm, well, let's get my brush going here. All right, that one's not going to work. Hang on. <laughs> we find another brush that's working. All right, here, let's see if this one's working. I got to squeeze, get some water flowing. All right, there we go. <clears throat> Ay, hang on, that one's not working either. Let me just get a regular brush and some water. <laughs> my water, I haven't used my water brushes in a while and they're not wanting to, uh, they're not wanting to work on a, on the fly. So let me get another, let me get another brush here. Okay, so let's do this again. So I'm going to put some down here on the thing. I'm going to put some water. <laughs> you can so anyway, you can uh, you can use your markers as a water as watercolor. Okay, that was a lot for uh, a little tiny demo, but I think you get the idea. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, yeah, throw the box. Well, I thought maybe I might cover the boxes and make something. I actually might make something with that. So you can use your super tips as a watercolor by just putting them down you can you know of course with these you got enough different colors right you got enough colors to choose from for skin tones but you can mix them right uh so you can use your super tips as watercolor okay <laughs> i think i could have just told y'all that but all right so i don't know if let me kind of see it looks like they're just a shade off so i'm not sure if there's 24 um 24 different shades or if there's a couple duplicates some of them look a little no they all they look a little bit different they all look just a little bit different just slightly but we'll have to do a test okay so we're going to have to do a test of these and um and see <clears throat> and see how they um uh, see how they uh there we go <laughs> See how they work. So they're all all right. So G said they all are different. They're all different. Okay, thanks, G. All right, so I'm gonna just move these up out of the way. Well, you know what? Let me just put them in the box for now. Let me just put them in here. I'm just gonna stick them back in here until I use them. Uh, then after I play with them and show you the different colors are going up on my they're going up on my marker pen build that I built. Um, I built that out of uh, foam core phone core and a pack of uh packing tape that's what that's built out of all right so there we go we got the 24 colors in there so thank you zandra and she sent me some candies and i love the papers of course you know we love our little our little uh <laughs> designs that can be cut out and used in planners journals or whatever so i'll keep a i'll keep a little bit of her uh paper there her cat mermaids or cat how would you say it mer mercats mercats <laughs> hi teresa all right so then she sent the 24 color colors of the world pencils and and if you, 
not that Prisma colors are expensive. I don't think Prisma colors are very expensive comparatively speaking to a lot of the different color pencils that are out there. Uh, but I think if you had to if you had to take a step down in price, uh, Crayola's pencils are really quite good. They really are quite good. So I'm assuming these are the same 24 colors that the markers are, um, that the markers are, uh, you know, same shades as the markers. So what I'll do is I, I don't know if I can, <laughs> I can match them up, but it would be nice to match up one of the markers and one of the pencils and see how they do. So if we don't get to this today, then we'll plan on doing this on Wednesday. The colors show different using the watercolor mess, so not much straight to paper. Yeah, you can you can do straight to paper with the markers and still move it with water, but depend that's all going to depend on the paper. It's going to depend on the paper how much they move. All right, so we're going to test those out together. Uh, if we don't do it today, we'll do it on Wednesday. We'll see how much time we have left. I mean, you know, how much time we we get to. All right. So, and thank you, Sandra. Thank you. I like to put these in the refrigerator. I like chocolate. That's I like cold chocolate. All right. Um, let's see. Yes, Crayolas are more the affordable. Um, yeah, they are good quality. Now, to me, though, nothing blends, not even polychromos. They're more for layering. But Prisma colors blend. And it's just that I've used Prisma colors since I was a kid or a teenager. So it's just that I always, I know my Prisma colors, like they're my friends. <laughs> so I do like my Holbys, my Polys, my Lumis, and the Crayolas. I like them all. But I, I'm just, you know, I like my Prisma because it's just what I've I'm just used to. And I know how they work. I know how they blend. I know how they layer. I know, I just know how they work. Okay. So next, um, I'm going to show you the cards and everything. But real quick, I've got, um, I pulled out one of my uh, travelers. This is one of my big, thick mama jambas. And uh, I pulled it out here because I want to save the tops off of my washi tapes. So Annie got me these washi tapes. Put this back over here. Annie, um, my daughter in L.A., sent me these uh, washi tapes. Last time she sent me some for my birthday, she got them, uh, I think, at a Japanese store somewhere in L.A. This time they came from a place in Texas. Um, Ian and Eunice out of Cypress, uh, let's see, Spring, Texas. It's Little Craft Place, Ian and Eunice. So this is where um, she got these washi tapes for me. And uh, yes, this is a chunky monkey. Yeah, I love my I love my big my big uh, travelers. I have different I have different ones for different things. So what I want to do though, is let me find this place over here. Let me go ahead and clip clip this here. So I'm going to put the these uh, tops on here, and then I'll I'll put the card, and then I'll write that it was from Annie here. So well, it's got a shine on it, so we won't do it right now. <laughs> Hi Kim, <laughs> let's see, Gracie. Uh, I said hi to Bethany, Kim, living good. I'm sure there's some people I'm missing. All right, so let me go this way because for some reason we have dark, right? Go dark here. Let's see what I can do. I probably need to turn off the uh, auto light to set it myself, which is a lot of times what I do, but it seems okay right now. All right, so what I'm going to do is get me a craft knife. And I just had a second ago. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Well, where'd it go? I don't know. I just had, did it roll somewhere? Oh, here it is. And uh, so I'm going to open these up and I'll just, I won't keep the backs here, but I want to keep the, the sticker on the top. So, and I'll show you my washies that she sent me. Y'all know, I don't have enough washies. <laughs> Okay. 
This one's called Gorgeous Beauty. And some of them will peel somewhat. They don't peel, then I just cut them off. I just cut the, the tops off of them and use them like a, you know, glue them in like a sticker. Because I just like to keep them. It's just a, it's a way to decorate your page and to keep, you know, keep the, uh, let's see, let's see. Maybe I'll zoom in one here. There we go. And I'll show you each one as we go. I'll show you each one as we go. Hi, Hedgie. How you doing? All right. All right. So this one, I want, to, I want you all to see them. Got to get them started here. Get it started together. There we go. Okay. So I'm just going to keep a little piece of one. Like that. Um, let's see. <clears throat> so there's that one. I'm going, I'm going through all of them. So get you a cup of coffee if you don't want <laughs> if you don't want to see a, a washi tape unboxing. <laughs> But I waited, guys. I've had these since the, you know, I've had these since before. Like, I think I got them on Wednesday, the day before my birthday, and I haven't opened them. I saved them till uh, we got together. So it's, you know, I was, uh, I was good and patient. This one's called Soupy, and it looks like it's herbs. So I'm going to cut, just cut them out. So I was uh, patient to uh, wait to open them with you guys. <laughs> Okay, so this one's called Soupy. And again, I'm just going to put some glue stick on it. And it is purple, but it dries clear. So it won't be purple uh, in, in an hour. Uh, you don't have enough washi either, Julia? <laughs> don't forget, guys. Um, oh, you like this idea? Yeah. And um, if you... If you have a lot of washi, you could keep it in a book. I do have them all in another book, but these are my special birthday ones, um, Selena. So I am uh, <laughs> I'm putting them in my travelers here. All right. So then let me just uh, get a little piece here. I'll have a get it started. Got little herbs. So this one's soupy. It's gonna go around the back side there. <laughs> All right, let's see. You would not have waited, Janet, to open them. <laughs> Janet, what are you doing today on your show? Are you streaming today? What are you? I get. I'm assuming you are. What are you? Um, what are you doing? And they, it's all written in Japanese. They're Japanese washi tapes. So, um, I mean, they are from Japan. Uh, so far, the what these are. Let's see. This one is. I think they all are from Japan. I think they're all from Japan. Washi is <laughs> a good one. Washi is like eating chocolates. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So this one is just called Paper Paper Plate Masking Tape is the title of this one. Paper Plate's got like, oh, I just cut into it. Let me, let me fix my little circle there. I just cut into it. <laughs> I cut into this one. That's all right. Okay. Don't look away when you're cutting. Don't look at chat while you're cutting. All right, so there we go. And this one has little mushrooms. Let's get it started here. Let's find the start. There it is. MT, yeah, MT's good too. I think that's the last one she got me, Gracie, or from MT. Yeah. Yes. I have a lot of MT brand. 
Annie always gets me, um, she knows that I like anything like Asian, Japanese. <laughs> she always, you know, before all the virus, she would go down to um, places in uh, LA and, and shop. But in this case, she just ordered it because, you know, everything's shut down. Well, I don't say everything. A lot of things are. So she um, she just ordered this again. She got it for me from Ian and Eunice Little Craft Place. Washi tape and planner supplies. Let's see if there a... Uh, it's called uh, hello at littlecraftplace.com. And they are on IG. So I'll go follow them on IG too. Okay, so here's this one. Keeps going. I think it goes to right there. Starts repeating. Isn't that cool? And I don't need all of this. I just want a little strip of it. So let me just run, run that down a little. <clears throat> Don't look away. <laughs> there we go, Lynette. There you go. Don't look away while you're cutting. <laughs> oh, oh, well, you got to laugh at your mistakes. You got to. Because we all make them. And if you don't laugh, you're, you know, you're going to just be living in a cave. Um, nothing to do with the virus. Okay. All right. So there we go. Let me kind of. There we go. All right. So there's that one. Next. Next. Let's go to this one. <clears throat> now, this one's, uh, this is only one I saw a price on. $6.99 for a roll of washi tape. Thank you, Annie. <laughs> Thank you, Annie. <laughs> I don't know if they're all that much. I don't know. This is the only one I saw with the price tag on it. So thank you, Annie. For all these beautiful, they're beautiful washi, <clears throat> beautiful washi tapes. I'm not going to lie. Japan, you know, the Japanese um, stationery and things like this are uh, stunning. And what's the girl, Rainbow, is it Rainbow Holic? If y'all don't follow Rainbow Holic, you need to follow Rainbow Holic. She does all kinds of Asian stationery, planners, um, and working. She works in her Hobonichi. And so rain, I think it's rainbow holic. Okay, so this one. Got to get it started here. You like to get it started evenly so you don't tear it. So there we go. Isn't that pretty pale pink okay just a little snippet All right hi Diana anybody else I missed thanks everybody for stopping in I'm gonna show some uh, I'm gonna show my um, what they don't teach you an art school book and some uh, cards, art cards, and a couple of my birthday cards and collage fodder that came in. So, yeah. Okay, so let's go to this next one. This one I think is called Path. This one called Path. I'm not sure. That might just be on the back. Let's see. Let's see what this one says on the front. This one says. Liang Feng, F-E-N-G, Feng, Feng, but it says Path on the back. Path might be the title of it. Okay, so just, we're going to unbox them all, or I should say unwrap. <laughs> oh, you never can have enough washi, I know, right? Okay, let's turn this. Trust me, I've shown how much washi I have, but Annie knows for my birthday, all right, let's see. I can get one more on here, then I'm going to flip the page. So let's put one down here. Whoops. All right, let's look at this one. I'll find it. Here we go. Well, 
look like little houses that goes this way. Look. Isn't that cool? All right, so I'm going to cut two little, cut this in half, and I'll put two to, next to each other. And just fold it on the back. There we go. All right. I can probably maybe get one more up there. I can get one of these small ones up there, I think. And let's just go to another page. All right, so let's see. Let's flip the page. Got three more. Y'all are being patient. <laughs> let's see. I miss Pepsi. Anybody else popping in? Love them, but those house ones. I know those house ones are cute, right? All right, so this one is called number one, an anemone. An 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 oh, I can't hardly say that. Anim anemone, you know, the sea creature. <laughs> That's always hard for me to say. All right, so let's see. I'll try to remember to put, um, let's see, where's, I want to put Jonna, Etsy, Selena, Etsy, and I want to put um, the link for Washi. Try to remember to put all that in the description box. Number one, spring flower anemone. I guess maybe there's a flower. Is there a flower called that as well? I just know the uh, the coral, you know, the uh, the sea creature in it. Me, and it, um, oh, y'all know what I mean. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. And again, the purple, the purple uh, glue stick dries clear. All right, let's see. Hi, Mama Four. So I said hi to Trisha. I know I'm missing people. I'm just trying to find the edge here. <laughs> There it is. Ooh, this one's pretty. Ooh, this looks like something that Xandra might need to order. Look, it's got a it's got like an iridescent shimmer. Look at that. I guess these are flowers. An anemone flower. Oh. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> it's got a shimmer. Um, where Nemo lives, yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what did Janet say? Please don't come. Oh, okay. She's talking to somebody in chat. Okay. Don't troll people. You'll just get booted out by the mods. Just saying. All right. So let's see what this one is. Two, this one and one more. Mm -mm. All right. Oh, these have little cats on them. Let me call them that. Okay, let's see. This is cats. And it's say, saying, I don't know if that's a, a word for cats or not, but it's beckoning cat. Beckoning cat is the name of it. <laughs> oh my gosh, how cute is this? Okay, let's get the edge of this one. Glue and stick. Oh, boy, makes me want to do the same. Yeah, I know, Diane. Get it out, girl. You can work long. Okay, here we go. There's the little cats. And, of course, there's two little white cats, just like my little cats. All right. All right, one more to go. Mast. All right, let's see what this one looks like. <clears throat> Last one. And we got tons of art cards to show you guys. I mean, I got so much show and tell today. It's just like a show and tell day. All right. 
All right. Let's see what this one. So thank you again, Annie, for all my awesome washies for my birthday. All right. Oh, this one's a, a little uh, <laughs> astronauts in space. Look. <laughs> oh, how cute. Oh, y'all know my space themes. She knows. She knows me. She knows me. So there we go. So I got some uh, more, and you can see this is a chunky book. And I and different different things are in different sections. So it is a big it is a big uh, travelers. Lots of inserts. I'm not sure how many I've got squeezed in this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine nine inserts in this one. Look at look how <laughs> look how jacked up all my elastics are. They're all, look, look at this one right here. <laughs> look at that one. Wait, look, look, this one goes, that one has a double, that one has a triple. <laughs> I just, what, however I can get them to stay in the book, I don't care how neat it looks on the edges. I know that probably freaks Janet out, but, uh, <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> yes, she does. All right, so there are all my, um, there's my birthday washies. So thank you so much, Annie. All right. So let me stack these over here off to the side for the moment. Out of the way, but still in proximity so I can stare at them. All right. There we go. All right, so I'm going to set this aside to somewhere, but I've got something else here in my spot. Now I'm going to move my little tray. There we go. All right. <clears throat> I'll stay halfway organized. All righty. So, oh, I need to put this in here. Hang on. I need to put this in with washi tape, though, because uh, let's go this way with these little buildings, these little houses. So let me get some. There we go. All right, now, next, I think we will go to, I think we're going to go to the art cards. I think I'll save, I'll save the book for a little bit, in a little bit. All right, so first off, in case y'all, uh, let me show this again. Y'all are just coming in. I have my stacks of collage fodder for the next batch. But um, I did varnish. I did varnish this one. And I did post this one on Instagram. And this one's from Donna Siebold, the, the stuff that she sent. And then I'm working on a second one with her stuff. This is just tacked down. Nothing's, nothing's painted or anything. But here's the base. This is the base of the stuff. Um that I'm going to work on this one. And then Becky Kalura, I did this one and varnished it. Okay, I still have to paint the backs, but this one's going to Becky. And then she had enough stuff for me to do this one that's still just laid out. It's not, and it just, it's all just tacked tack down. It's just laid out. Nothing else has been done. So there's that in the collage department. And so let me show you some birthday cards that I got. I'll show you the ones I got from Cam and Boo because they're so cute. All right. So Cam gave me this birthday card. <laughs> he wrote a nice note down there, but look, isn't that cute? So Cam, Cam gave me that one. Denise gave me a beautiful sentimental one. Boo gave me this one. All right. Let's see if I can get it to work here.
it's wanting to it's wanting to stick and <laughs> okay, I better stop because of the uh, song. <laughs> All right. And then Janet, I mean, Janet, bless her heart. She sent this <laughs> mid-December and I just got her Christmas card. <laughs> I got this like Saturday. And she sends it to my house. It doesn't even go to my P.O. box. She sends it to my house. So I got one of her prints and her Christmas card. I got it like two months. Two months. Almost two months. So thank you, Janet. So this, this I'll keep this with her other one that I have. I think I have two of hers. So anyway. Uh, and then Julie Topaz, my mod Julie, sent me this one. And she, they, everybody wrote nice things. And I just, I'll just show the cards. I'm not going to read all the sentiments. But thank you, Julie. And I love the envelope, too. The envelope that it came in, Julie. Thank you, Julie. And then this one came from Lynette Porter. So Lynette Porter sent me this one and she sent me some bookmarks. I love these magnetic bookmarks. And I, again, I waited to use them till I could show them. But Hubster goes, do you have a bookmark? And I went, well, yeah, but you know, you can't have one. No, I found him a paper one. But I love these magnetic, these magnetic uh, bookmarks. So thank you, Lynette. <laughs> and the card, look, it's got like a twall, is that what it's called? Tool? Tool. I think it's tool uh, on there and it's all it's like sewn on there it's so pretty I love it so thank you Lynette I think I saw her here a little while ago and let's see then I got a card here I got one from Scoobs and Scoobs again thank you so much I did get to tell Scoobs she sent me a nice letter she sent me a nice letter and a beautiful dragonfly card. And she sent me sent me a birthday check. So thank you so much, Scoobs. And uh, but I love that. Look, it looks like it's glowing from underwater. You can see it there. And again, the envelope, too. Here's the back side. The envelope um, has a dragonfly, which I'll cut that out. So, and a nice letter. Thank you so much, Scoobs. Um, let's see what's next. All right, so now. I'm going to try not to show. Let's see if I show this side. I think I'm good. All these. <laughs> I got art cards to show people. Art cards. All right. So let's see. Let's start here with um, CB. I haven't seen CB yet this morning. So CB was worried that her cards would be too thick. So she made a separate stack. Separate set. So. <laughs> so. Um. So um, Carol CB made these beautiful mermaids, but look how she was worried that they were going to be too puffy. Um, what I'll do is I'll, I'm going to swap Carol because she did two sets. So what I'm going to do is I'll just make sure that these go in the U.S. Sorry, uh, sorry, international, but I'm not mailing these, but I will swap them out for you, um, uh, CB. I'll sit, I'll do your both your sets. But um, these won't go international. So aren't they pretty? Okay, so here's her second set. Let me put the face in the right way. CB is an, a, an awesome artist and card maker and just an artist in general. And I do have something that she's drawn here. But um, she, doesn't, uh, she doesn't post it enough. I know, right, Devin? I know. I love them. But she, and and they are too, really thicker than I, you know, we need. But I as long as I can send these in the US. All right, they'll I'll just put extra postage for those. All right, so here's her other set. I like to show the backs first. So here's the back of her second set. And here are her hummingbirds and she did pop dot. And that's okay. That's not too thick. Just a pop dot's not bad. But um, yeah, because they'll they'll you know we you, they'll be fine in an envelope. So here's CB's uh, fantasy garden. Is she here? I don't see her. 
Yeah, everybody's LCB. I know, right, Carla? I know. So I know, guys. Everybody's going, oh, so pretty. So CB, you'll have to go back and watch the um, look at the chat to see everybody's comments. Let me get the light coming back here. There we go. There we go. So let me hold one up. I like this one with the flowers. It's got glitter. Look at that, guys. Isn't it pretty? And look at the little the ruby red throated hummingbirds got uh, red glitter on him. I love them all. <laughs> so good job, CB. And then she sent, or of course, a self-addressed stamped envelope. And she sent me a note telling me, I didn't know that we weren't supposed to do too thick until later. And so, and she sent postage. So thank you for that. And uh, here is some of her art. This is some of CB's art there. It's just on a, on a piece of paper. So it's not as pretty as you would see it in person but uh yeah cb's an awesome artist so thank you so much cb for the postage and the letter this will go in your um fibs book that will go in the fibs book after the swap i keep everything together i keep it except the money i keep everything together uh until the actual swap so that nothing gets um nothing gets um no, let's see i don't have the envelope Nothing gets, um, what do you call it, um, displaced. I'm going to put a rubber band around this. This came in a big envelope. And I think this came in that, I don't remember. No, I think this might have come. I'm not sure this came in Xandra's. This may have came in Xandra's. This little uh, acetate cat. <laughs> cute. It fell out of uh, one of the envelopes. It's a little acetate cat. That is so cute. That'll go in my journal too. All right. So let's just keep everything nice and together here. So let's see these. All right. Next, where's my other stack? Here we go. All right. I'm just pulling out from the envelope. All right. Next I have, I mean, out of the what do you call it? The tub here, the tub. All right. Next I have, um, hang on. Ugh. All right. This one is Devin Rex and she is here. Yolanda. I, is it Yolanda or how do you say your real name? I mean, cause it's, everybody knows you. Everybody knows what your real name is, but I'm not sure how you pronounce it. Cause it ends, it ends in a, in a E. Do you have an A? Do you say Yolanda? Oh, there's CB. Oh, there she is. I didn't see you come in, CB. Let me click on you there. So, yeah, awesome art and card, CB. Awesome. All right. So let me show you first. She sent me a birthday card. <clears throat> sent me this pretty birthday card. If y'all didn't, if y'all miss seeing Devin, um, Devin Rex art on Janet and I did an interview on, with her on Thursday. It's up on my channel. It's the last video before this one. So she sent me a nice uh, birthday card. Yoland. Yoland. Okay. So it's just like Yoland. Yo. Yoland. I like that. <laughs> I like Yoland. I'm writing that down. <laughs> I like that. This is fun to say. Yo land. <laughs> Yo. Okay. And she also sent, and I'll show this in a minute. She sent, uh, and here's one of the little things, some um, collage fodder to make her a collage. So here are a few jelly prints and some odds and ends. So I'll set that aside. And collage fodder. So I guess it's all together. So she had it all wrapped up in this this paper and it did i did have to tear it to get it off of everything but here's some collage fodder and then she said this is for me so but i'll i'll use whatever i'll show you that in a minute so and then she sent let's see i think i already did you sent cards earlier didn't you Devin? your cards already came in i think your cards already came in then she sent um she sent these napkins look at these succulents and some other napkins here so these will go in my napkin stash. Look at this one, guys. Love this one. 
love this one. This might have to be the base of your um, of your collage, Devin. This might have to be the base of your collage. I'm gonna have to keep this and this with your collage fodder until I decide. Because this might have to be your base collage. But look at this. Look at these beautiful napkins, guys. Look at that. So if y'all don't do napkin journaling, <laughs> then you may not understand why we get excited over decorative napkins. <laughs> Flamingos, a chicken, and look at this one, Paris map. So these will go in my um, napkin collection, but I'm going to keep these out, Devin, because I might use these. I might use those in your collage. All right, so let me put this with my napkins. And let's look at the collage fodder and stuff. So she has these little tiny things, these little things. <laughs> she has these little bitty things in here. There's another one I just dropped on the floor. <clears throat> Little bitty things for the collage. I know, isn't it, Holly? All right, so collage fodder package. So let's see how I can do this. I'm gonna have to get some. Let me get a couple of uh, paper clips. some paper clips out of my bucket out of my bucket of paper clips here all right and so let's see what she sent she had it all wrapped up all different ways with the oh see look little things are dropping out <laughs> did i get them all out of there i think so so these are probably some of her own art um some of her art art papers punched so these will be good for planets. Y'all know I love me. I love my punched art papers for planets. So, yeah. So cool planets. And let's see what she has here. She has this horse with the, um, you know, reflecting pool. And this is what, this is right here, guys. This is one of her, uh, her, um, what do you call it? What kind of print do you call this? Uh, What's this called again, Devin? Not I keep jelly plate is stuck in my head, but what kind of print is this? So these she makes these transfers, transfers. She does these transfers. Um, you create all oh, thanks, Judy. <laughs> so these are her transfer papers. And uh, then here's somebody, there's a couple people talking there. Here's a uh, door and a path this is the um this is i think this is um the what you call it in sydney the opera house some little birds some little fish some more little fish yeah fishy 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 <laughs> uh, some building construction some flowers a little frog. She's got, she sent me the, she sent me the uh, zoo. <laughs> okay, so there we go. So Devin said they are magazine image transfers on jelly plate. So, and she does show this stuff on her channel, guys. So, and she showed some on the video that Janet and I interviewed her on last, uh, last uh, Thursday. So these are going to be fun. This will be fun, Devin. Yo, Devin. <laughs> so that is all her collage fodder, but I am going to keep this napkin and this napkin with it because I think somehow I might want to use that. And the planets. Let's just pin that together. And then here are some things that she said she sent for me. And look at the little washi tape. See, this needs to go in my book where I was just at. Look. Look at that little washi tape with the little cactus. <laughs> Uh, okay, so let's see what she sent me here. I did glance at it, guys. I didn't uh, go through it heavily, but I did glance at it. Let's see. Let's uh, let me get this side open too, because it's the papers, the actual papers. 
So I hope y'all are enjoying seeing uh, some of my birthday haul and uh, and your art cards that you guys are sending. Again, we, you have until the 24th to get them to me. So uh, get them to me by the 24th. And uh, you can be in the swap. All the details are in the community tab under the under my videos in my YouTube channel, community. Go in the community tab, and you can read all about the description, what you need to do, and all that for uh, to be in the uh, three art card fantasy card swap. Okay? Open the back. I'm going to... I'm going to this right here. I'm going to, Devin. Hang on, girl. Girl. Yo. <laughs> I had to take the washi tape off. <laughs> oh, my gosh. You two, you guys. Um, so here's some of her. Look, here's some of her, um, her papers. Look, here's one. Look at this one, guys. It's got a B on it. I love this one. This is just right up my alley. This one be right up my alley, Devin. <laughs> B. <laughs> Hi, Ray. <laughs> Hi, Riri. <laughs> uh, art cards. Oh, the art cards came separately. Okay, so I don't know if I, I opened yours yet or not. I still have a whole bucket full here. I got a whole bucket right here. So if they're if if I have not opened them yet, Devin, then they're probably in there. <laughs> We're gonna get to all of them. But I love this. I love this. This I think this is one of my favorites that I've seen you do because I guess I just like the the color and it looks like a um it looks like an old uh, plate like a you know what are those called the plates you know where you print off printing plates you know metal printing plates. That's what it looks like. So I love that. I love it all. Okay, then she sent this paper. A B. Everything's B. A B happy. See, I'll use this stuff. Here's a little um, what is this? Oh, some washi tapes. Oh, look, she there's she's got all this little stuff. It's so cute. There's some washi tapes wrapped around a card. <laughs> Hi, scrapbook fun. Welcome. Good to have you. You're new. Here's a little die cut. Probably jelly plated. Here's some more little um, faux ephemera. Hyacinth. And then these. I love it all. I love it all so much. And uh, I will use this and we'll put this right here. Let me put, uh, I think your name might be in there, but I'm going to go ahead and um, all right, let me stack that over there, Devin. Collage. All right. Yo, Devin. <laughs> all right, so this will go in the ones I'm to make, okay? I have a pile of those. And then this will just be my treasure. This will be my treasure here. I still want to put your name on it. Some of this could probably go in the Fibs book. The Fibs book. Let me put a little paper clip. Put Devin. See, I, I keep it pretty organized, guys. I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty good about that. Okay, so this is Devin for me. I'm going to put that on there so I don't confuse it. And then she also sent me the birthday card. So let me take the birthday card and put this with this. There we go. All right. So I'm keep that separate. All righty. Next, we have Julie. Julie Topaz, who's the mod, one of the mods here. This is her art cards. Okay, let me not show any addresses on the self-addressed stamped envelope. All right, so again, um, I thought these were so, I loved what you wrote on them all. I love I love them, Julie. So let's turn them around first. They, they go, uh, hers go horizontal. So here we go. Julie, Topaz Pearl Girl, the backs of them. 
Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, uh, Rebecca, yes. Some, one of the girls can put a link for you. Okay. Bam. I love this. I love that she made them so personal. Look, meet me by the sea. I love this. I mean, I haven't seen anybody write on theirs yet, Julie. So I love this. Meet me by the sea. I need vitamin C. <laughs> I love that. I love that. And this one's a Van Gogh um, quote. The heart of man is very much like the sea. It has its storms. It has its tide. And in its depth, it has its pearls too. Isn't that awesome? I love them, Julie. I love them. Thank you so much. Let me keep them all together. I keep everything in the original envelopes till we swap. All right. Got my little piles here. All right. Next. Next we have, let's see here. No name on the envelope. So let's see who these are. APG Jamie. So APG Jamie, and she even sent some extra stamps for for out of country people. That was nice. Thank you, Jamie. She's not out of country. She just sent some extras. Thank you so much. And <laughs> Jamie. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta get the washi tape off of them, and I'll keep those little slabs of washi tape. Hang on. So she always writes funny things on, she writes funny things on her letters and her notes and everything. This one I think, okay, she did write a little something on the back. All right, let me turn them all around and let me uh, read what she says on the backs. It's nice to hang out in the wingnut garden with my butt on chair. <laughs> and then she said um, where you can find her. She wrote her Twitter, Facebook. She's APG Jamie, I think pretty much everywhere. Coffee and Art in the Morning, Art Card Swap 2021. She's got a little uh, chair stickers on each one. Now, wait for it. Are y'all ready? Y'all know Jamie, right? <laughs> she put her picture. Look, guys, she put her picture. Uh, her picture on each one. Uh, Jamie, you're such, you're such a hoot, Jamie. <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> I know right <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> and she if you ever got any happy mail from Jamie they're all funny she always writes funny things and she is she's a poet this APG Jamie is artist poet girl that's what APG stands for, Artist Poet Girl. She's a poet. She is. <laughs> I know. I know. The wing nut. Look, they're little wing nuts, guys. Look, like little, like little screws and little wing nuts. Do y'all see? And they have little wings. They have little wings. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> I know. I know she is Janet. She is a hoot. So there's the wing nut cards, the wing nut garden. <laughs> Very clever. Very clever, Jamie. <laughs> so I haven't seen her here, but Jamie, th thank you for participating. They are awesome. Okay. So then I'll take the stamps off and her address and put everything in the envelope until I swap out. Swap out. All right. Next, I'm going through the bucket here. All right. So next out of the bucket, let's see who we have. We have Anne Le LeClerc. Anne LeClerc. She's inter one of our international ladies. So Jamie, you're buying her postage back. I looked at these already and I love them. Um, Jan, you, Jan, is it, jar, oh, jar, sorry, geranium, geranium, but they're like, they're, you'll see when I turn them over, they're her gardens, her fantasy gardens are in jars, geranium, look, <laughs> uh, 
she has little gardens in jars. So yeah, geranium. <laughs> oh, so thank you, Anne. I know, aren't they cool? Yeah. Hi, Betta Dust, by the way. Anybody else I missed? I know I'm missing people coming in. Hi, Elaine. I know, CB, aren't they good? Look, Jarrania. <laughs> I know, I know. I don't know if Ann's here or not. Hi, Starla. Who else am I missing? So everybody's liking them. If y'all miss uh, the chat, you'll have to go back uh, and, and go to the chat when the video renders and read the comments. I know, right? Jar gardens, right? And I know it is clever. Everyone's just so different. I love all the cards. I'm just saying. Everyone is just special to me. I love all of them. So I'm trying to click on some of the comments that everybody says. So, yeah. Jaranium. <laughs> so thank you Anne and thank you Jamie for the stamps thank you CB for the extra money for the postage for the internationals alright next let's see who do we have next and I, I'm going to go to the post office if Hubster doesn't go by tonight and check it I will go tomorrow so Wednesday I'll probably have some more alright so let's see here this one's from, from Wendy R. I don't know if she said her last name before, but Wendy R. I've been a longtime watcher of your streams. However, I chose to be a quiet lurker. I'm not on social media either. I'm reading her note. Anyway, I've never done an art card swap. And being that it was only three cards, I said, well, hey, that's doable, right? So here they are. Thank you for hosting this and thank you for radiating your humor and and boundless inspiration. It is much appreciated. Be well and art on Wendy R. I'm including some international postage and she did. She sent her own stamped envelope, but she also sent a lot of international postage. So thank you, Wendy R. I don't mind saying people's last names if I know that they've said it here, but sometimes I'm not sure if people have said their last name, so I'm kind of careful about that. Okay, so here we go. Let me turn them all around, going the right way. This one is a horizontal and two verticals. And, um, yeah, she just has Wendy R on her card. So she just has Wendy R, so that's what I'm going to say. So here's the backs of hers. You like that? No, Carla. So here we go. This is her first time doing a swap. So I think she did awesome. Fantasy Gardens. I think this one. No, that's the way it goes. Uh, Fantasy Garden. She did two different ones. Look, I love. Have y'all ever seen these stack stones before? I don't know how they do that. Stack stones. I don't know if that's supposed to go this way. I think that's supposed to go that way. She just put the name upside down. Have y'all ever seen those before? Those are it's amazing to see those stacked stones. So thank you so much, Wendy. Look at this one. And look at this one with the hanging, the hanging garden. Oh, it's all hand painted, guys. This is all hand painted. She hand painted these. I know. Let's click on some here. People are saying beautiful. I know, aren't they? Look, it's all they're like little paintings. <clears throat> They're all hand painted. I'm trying to click on some of the comments. Aww. <laughs> so thank and hi, uh, Jonica, jo jo Jonica, Jonica. Thanks, Jonica, for being here. Welcome to the to the channel. So look at that a little tiny butterfly. But I love this. I think that's really clever. But I love these flowers. It's all hand painted, guys. So thank you so much, Wendy. Did awesome. And thank you for the stamps. Thank you all that sent extra stamps so that I can uh, uh, do the international ladies for free. 
uh, the stamp, the uh, postage for them. Because, you know, it's hard sometimes for them to get. Devin's the one that told me. I didn't know that you. it was so hard to get, um, what do you call it, international, you know, return. Not everybody can do that. And so and I asked my post office, I said, can, can international people buy a stamp over there that we can send back to them? She goes, no. <laughs> no, some, some countries maybe. She goes, but no. Okay, so this one, hang on, let me open up the little note here. This is from Elizabeth <clears throat> Elizabeth Newell, and she did write this letter. Dear Dee Dee, thank you for creating the art card swap. This is the first time I've made art cards. I have a costume design business. I had, sorry, I had a costume design business in the 80s. I went to Egypt during that time too. My friend, I don't know if I want to say the names of the friend. It could be just someone famous, but I'm not sure. I should say, I guess it's okay. I think it was a famous person that did um, designs. Okay, so my friend Howard Hop Hopkirk drew two Egyptian figures wearing jackets that I designed. It's been many years since I used the figures. I had fun playing with them on these cards. Your streams, I watched the YouTube videos, have inspired me and also keep my spirits up. I appreciate your generosity in sharing your art and your laughter. Warmest wishes, Elizabeth Newell. P.S. I received the thank you gift you sent, sent. Oh, she was one of the ones we did the brush lettering. We did her name in brush lettering. And uh, she says she's learning the etiquette and apologize for not sending an email. You didn't have to, you did not have to send emails. You did not have to send emails. So she has each one of hers. Let me put the little papers here. She has each one of hers have a little cover on them. I think she, uh, she put a varnish. Let me turn them over. So the backs like this, she has her information here and she has each one covered with a little piece of tissue paper. And look at these guys, look. So she was a, she was a designer in the eighties and look, aren't these awesome? <laughs> so there's her fantasy garden. Did I say hi to you, Boney? Good morning. And I think so hi to Marie. So look, I know, <laughs> let me hold up one kind of close so you can see. I know, aren't they Starla? So thanks everybody. I know <clears throat> they're all so unique. Everybody's cards are so unique. So thank you so much, Elizabeth, for participating. It's nice to have people that have never made art cards or never participated in a swap <coughs> to, um, to be in it. Walk like an Egyptian. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I know, right, guys? Oh, so Trisha says she's been to Egypt. Watts definitely bring back memories. Aw. So she has a little, a little cover on each one to protect them, which I thought was nice. All right, hang on. Let me get my letters. And the letters after the swap is all done. Like right now, I keep everything together. And she did send some, um, she did send some postage as well. So thank you so much for the postage. All you that are sending postage or a few dollars to help cover the postage, thank you so much. Um, all the, um, what do you call it, the letters and notes, they'll go in the Fibs book. Hang on, I'm making a note. Okay. So, but in the meantime, I keep everything in there in the envelopes look at the look she has an eye a raw stamp on her envelope thank you elizabeth okay i know i miss it <clears throat> lots of comments from all of you guys thanks so much i'm trying to click on a few at least okay so this one are y'all enjoying this 
I love seeing each and every one. All right. So this one is from Ashley. Ashley, I don't know if she wants to say her last name. Okay, it's on her card. Ashley St. Pierre. It is on the card. If it's on the card, then, you know, it's going to get said because, yeah, <laughs> because it's on your card and you don't know who it's going to. Okay, so let's get them all going the same way here. And hers are a little different size. It doesn't matter, guys. This is not a, a you know, ATCs. It's real, it's real, uh, they're, it's kind of particular because an ATC artist trading cards are all three and a half by two and a half. That's just a standard size. But my art cards, which I said, I said three by four, it's okay if they're a little bit different size because, you know, it's no big deal. So here's the back. They're just a little taller. Fine with me. And here they are. <clears throat> so again, thank you so much, Ashley. She's got washi tape flowers look it's just like it's just a fantasy garden i know erica right i said my gosh and hopefully they get there well, they may be here erica i'm still going these are the ones that i got um oh you sent it last week okay well i was gonna say i'm still going through the ones that i got since uh the last time i showed them was last wednesday so if they came in thursday friday saturday if they came in those days then then I, i'm showing them now so, yeah, I know, right? So very pretty. I know, right? So I'm trying to click. I'm trying to click on some of the comments. So thank you so much, Ashley. And again, I'm keep everything together until I do the swap. <laughs> I'm very organized with my swaps for the most part. Okay, so the next one is Marie. Marie was here earlier. Marie Schwab, you're, she was here earlier. She's still here, Marie. So Marie sent, she, I guess she goes, you know, Dee Dee's, Dee Dee's going to be able to use all these leftover stamps. I am looking at all this. Thank you, Marie, for all these stamps. So she has some, you know, just different, different amounts of stamps and forever stamps and different, um, you know, different uh, amounts of stamps. So thank you, Marie, for all those stamps. And um, she sent me a nice little card here. Sent me a nice card. This swap was fun. Thank you for the wonderful journey you take us on every time you speak and courage. Go, go live and just be you. Not sure how long I've been following you, but I'm so grateful I found you all those years ago. Although I don't get to see you live or get to watch all your videos much, I do get to know you. I I do get to know you are out there when I need you. My grands are so young and are growing up so fast, but one day they will no longer need grandma, and then I will be able to spend more time in my second happy place. P.S. on the back. Um, she said she sent the stamps um, that they were left over from when she was working. I hope it helps. It does help, Marie. There she is. There's Marie. Thank you, Marie. All right. So let's see. She has hers are all in little, um, she has hers in little sleeves. These are awesome, Marie. Okay. So here's the backs. Artist card, Dee Dee Swap, Fantasy Garden, January, February. And she has her name and her Twitter name and her Instagram and all that. Wait for it. Wait for it. Look. Look how fun these are. Look how fun these are, Marie. These are so fun. And I love the, the black, white, and yellow, and, and blue, gray. I love the color combination, too. So I know, right, in some of these, uh, like like uh, CB is no Marie forever. Hi, Afro sister. How's it going? I know I'm missing people coming in. So... I'm going to click on some of the comments. I know. Aren't they awesome? Look at those. This has this took you some while. I'm just, I'm guessing these took you a while, didn't they, Marie? Yeah, there's Joyce. E. Yes, Tangled Gardens. Yes. <laughs> awesome. I know these probably took a while. No, no kidding. <laughs> So they're awesome, Marie. Thank you so much for participating. I know. 
Holly D says they're interesting. Yeah, they're Zintangles. So thank you, Marie, for participating. And thanks for the stamps. And again, guys, y'all have until the 24th. If, you, if you're international, you might be pushing your luck. But in the States, you probably have time if you get right on it to get a set. Again, all the details of the swap are in the community tab on my YouTube channel. All right. Let's see what we got. We still got more, guys. Got more. All right. Let's see who this one's from. I did have them all opened anyway, so let's see. All right. <clears throat> Okay, this one is Terry. Let's see, does she have her last name? I mean, does she want her last name said? Um, I don't know if she wants her last Let me see what's on the back of her card. Terry, okay, she does have her last name on the cards. Terry Brett, she's in the UK. She sent me a little birthday card and a little sentiment. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Terry, for the birthday card. So I'll put that with my birthday cards. And she has a little note here. Hang on. Okay. And then um, the notes, again, the notes will go in the uh, Fibs book. Dear Dee, I'm keeping my fingers crossed that these will arrive in time to be included in the swap. If they don't, please don't send, re don't bother returning them. That's okay. They got here on time. They are not brilliant, but the best I could do and wanted to join in. Being in England, I can't always make live streams, but I always watch later on and always learn a lot. Thank you. I know your birthday card will be late, but it's not. Was posting this to you anyway. Thought, why not include one? Hope you had a good day. Love, Terry. So, Terry Brett, let me show you. Let me turn them around. These are awesome. Terry Brett in England. She does have uh, her, she has her email. So, you know, here we go. Fantasy Garden. So Terry Brett in England. And here we go. Look, guys. Look at these collage fantasy gardens. <laughs> I love this. Look. I love the color combination in the in the pattern. So they're all different. And you can have them, you can have them all the same, or you can have them all different. It's totally up to you. You just have to have three fantasy garden cards. They can be same or different. So here we go. So, um, oh, there she is. There she is. Uh, oh, no, the inside came unstuck. The inside came, oh, you mean the, uh, oh, you had the, uh, what do you call it? Oh, that's okay. She just had the sentiment stuck on there. That's all right. Uh, I know, aren't they good? So I'm going to show, show them each at a time. I love them. Thank you, Terry. Thank you so much. Let me click on some of the comments here. And here's some unicorns in space. And look, it's got the star, the uh, star constellations in the background. I know that it's hard to choose a favorite, right, Holly? I know. I don't know. I like them each one for their own reason. I like this one because it's got this constellation and the unicorn or the peg. Yes, unicorn. Then I like this one because of the collage, but I like this one because of the colors and the I like them all for different reasons. Thank you so much, guys, for participating. Peg Pegacorn, yeah. Pegasus unicorn. Yeah, there you go. Bed of dust. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Where's Zippy? I know. <laughs> so look, guys, let me hold them there for a second so you can see them all. Aren't they awesome? I love, I, of course, you know me, I love collage, but I'm loving all the cards, guys. I seriously am. Thank you so much. And again, the letters will go in the Fibs book. All right, let's see. I got my little stack of red keeping. I'm doing a little organizing circle here. All right, next we have Sharon and she and Sharon Lombard. Every I think everybody knows her name too. Sharon Lombard. Okay, so here she's got self-addressed stamp envelope. She's got each one. She has a little tissue on her cards too. Sent me a note. Let's see what she says here. 
She says, Dear Dee Dee, thank you so much for setting for letting us who watch replays to participate in the swap. Um yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. I know CBC because Dee Dee, you can't keep them all. <laughs> I know. Okay. Thank you for letting us who watch replays to participate in the swap. I watch the replays most of the time. Uh, uh, okay. All because of the time zone. I'm in the Pacific Northwest. I love what you do. Just a fib friend in the box, Sharon. Okay. So let me show you hers. Hang on. Let me get the little, y'all are going to love these. Oh, you're going to love them all. I love them all. <laughs> I love everyone. All right, so let me separate them. She has little tissues on each one. Let me flip them over for you so you can see. So she has, here's the bags, the Fantasy Garden Dee Dee Swap. And then she's got them covered. So I'm going to take the tissue off of each one. So here we go. <laughs> How cute. Got a little bit of glitter in the wings there. This one. This one, the little fairy on the mushroom. Aren't they? I know. That's going on. I know. I don't know if Sharon's here. I'm trying to get cap I'm trying to capture the glitter. I know the dragon one. I know the dragon one is cute. This one's got the little fairy. Okay. And then this one has the unicorn <laughs> in the little in the little um, arch there, the little you know little secret spot. Okay, I know I was saying there you go. I'm trying to click on some of the comments. You can am I am I get shining the glit? There we go. Trying to get the glitter to shine. Aren't they sweet? I love them. So she has them covered with the, to protect, I'm sure to protect the glitter. <clears throat> so let me hold up one more time. I know they do look like book covers. They do look like little book covers. Don't they, Abigail? Trying to click on some of the comments. Okay, let me put the little. If you put a, if you keep, you had a sleeve or a, a, if it was in a little envelope or you have the little tissue, that's how I'm going to make sure that they get sent. So thank you for that and the nice letter. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching recordings, guys, because I know. You know, different time zones. All right. Let's see who's next. We've got a few more here, guys. All right. <clears throat> Erica. Let's see what she says on her name. Try to be respectful. Let's see what she says on the back of the cards. Um, she just has, well, she does have Erica. I'm not sure if she wants her last name said. And I'm not sure how to pronounce it. V-O-G-T, Erica. And she does have it on the back of her card. So it's, I'm not sure how she says her name. And these are a little larger, which is fine. She's on IG, and that's what she put on there. Erica A-D-D-I-E-V-O-G-T. And um, so that's what's on the back of her card. So let me show you the backs real quick. So here's what she has on the back. There's her name on IG, if you want to follow her. It's at Erica Addy, A-D-D-I-E, V-O-G-T. So Erica, so here's Erica. They're a little bigger. That's okay. So look, she has these little worlds going on here. And she has different quotes on each one. Let me take one at a time. A huge glimpse of the sublime. I feel a responsibility to tell these stories. Of course, y'all know me. I'm going to love some collage. And this one, 
Art provides us with alternative perspectives and fortifies us. Aren't they cool? I know, I know I'm not catching people's comments. I know. Hi, Amber, by the way. Hi, Amber. And this one says something original actually worth lingering in. I love the little waterfall there. I love that. I just love that. Because see, these are the kind of things where you see stories in. I do anyway. I see little stories in here. And depending on what you have, like what an apple or water or a gate or what it represents to you. Because look, she's got a, a bit apple on each one. And these other... Um, these other fruits and uh, flowers. She has it on each one. So, you know, maybe that means something to her or maybe she's trying to say, you know, say something. And so, you know, it's what's in you. That's when you look at any kind of surrealism, you know, if, like Dolly, I always use him as an example. If you didn't know what Dolly was saying in, in, in different um, pieces of his art, then you would imagine what he meant or you would see what things mean to you. So something that means something to you is what you're going to see in it. So these are really lovely. I know. I know, Devin, each one. Yeah, each one has a little apple with a bite out of it. So thank you so much, Erica. Those are awesome. Those are awesome. And she has a little note here for thanks for inspiring me to work create cre creatively into my <laughs> thanks for inspire me to work creativity into my everyday life. You are a gift, Erica. So thank you, Erica. Okay. Let's see what we got here. We've got two more, I think. Two more packs here. Okay, so let's see. Um, this is from Donna. This is from Donna that's in Trinidad. She's usually here. So this is Donna in Trinidad. And she sent a nice big envelope here to send them back in. So Donna has a note. Let's see what she says here. Hang on, guys. Let me separate this out. Here we go. Hi, Dee Dee. Don't know what a self-addressed <laughs> Oh, I thought I made it clear. It's just an envelope that's been addressed. But you're in Trinidad, so I'm paying for the postage anyway. So don't worry about it. So don't worry about it. Oh, my gosh, Donna. Um, so she sent the following. I uh, can't thank you too much. Uh, and, and it's not too expensive. I'm paying for it. Well, the girls are paying for it. They sent stamps and international and money. So it's all good, guys. I did not... Um, she says she did not like her cards. I did not something like my cards. But I hope they're all right. They're awesome. I don't know why you didn't like them. So Fantasy Garden. And she has her um, name and Trinidad and Tobago on the back. Let me get them all going the same way so I can do the flip for you. So she has one horizontal and two vertical. Okay, so here we go. So here's the back. She even varnished the back. Look at that, guys. <laughs> okay. Oh, hi, Erica. You had so much fun. Oh, thanks, Erica. I didn't know that you were Erica. You know, see, sometimes all, all names that we use on here. So Erica Lynn. Thank you, Erica Lynn. Oh, I'm so glad you had fun. I'm so glad you have it. They're awesome. Okay, there's Erica at Erica Colors on IG. Let me write that down real quick because it's going to flow away and I'm going to miss it. Let me get it. <clears throat> Erica Lynn. Erica Colors. I might already follow you. It sounds familiar, but I'm going to write it down anyway. Okay, Erica Colors. Okay, so let's get back here to Donna. So Donna is in Trinidad, Tobago. 
And she thought, look at that nice varnish. Wow. <laughs> all right, here we go. So here we are. Look, look, I love them. They all have this texture. I think she used some kind of texture paste on them. They all are textured. Can y'all see? And then she varnished it too. So it kind of levels it off. But look, they're all, they're all, uh, here's her fantasy gardens. Let me do one at a time. Awesome, Donna. I know. I'm going to try to click on some names. <clears throat> Show them all off. Oh, they do remind you of pottery. <gasps> Bed of dust, they do. They do remind me of pottery, too. Good, good observation. I know the shine and the texture. It does remind me of pottery, though. <laughs> Trisha. <laughs> so thank you so much for participating, guys. All of y'all. Okay, I think I have one more. Yeah, she was concerned about what the self-addressed stamp, the envelope, and all that, but we're good. We're good. Everybody's sent in um extra stamps and uh and money to pay for it, the international so thank you okay so let me put a paper clip on this keep that together oh, i got one more here in the bucket and this is from julia let me see if i let's see what's on her car she sent she i think she sent collage stuff and birthday stuff too so let me do all this separately all right, hang on. There's a big pile. Hang on. Let's see what she got here. Here's some of our art cards and some other stuff here. Let's see. There's a sticker there. I'm trying to get the sticker. <clears throat> okay, got something stuck on the sticker. Hang on, guys. I'm going to have to cut this little sticker. Hang on. I got it stuck on the stuck on the uh, tassel here there we go all right so let's see these are the art cards let's see what she's got a note here i think that's an envelope oh that's cute okay so she's got collage fodder let's see what let's sort this real quick okay there's a wildlife artist that she's okay let's see dear Dee, Dee your videos just fill my day with fun there's not much of that going around now and at our age and quarantine thankful for you and the inspiration and joy you share julia and let me see let me let me look at her cards to see if she has her last name on there yeah she does all right so julia o'hara so let me show you the cards here i think she's got a little envelope for each one yeah she does hang on well she sent me oh okay i see what it is she sent me my own Okay, so she has them in little sleeves here. Hang on. I'm going to show y'all everything. Okay, so yeah. <clears throat> so these are the cards. And then she sent me this saying, there's a little note in here that this is one of her, um, Ray Harm is a Kentucky wildlife artist. So she sent me this card here that's from uh, one of the Kentucky wildlife artists. She wrote the note on the back to, to point out him. Okay. Then she sent some stamps, some extra stamps. Oh, she must know that I need <laughs> She sent me a, um, a magnifying bookmark. A magnifying glass. I, I, I'm seriously, I do have a couple of these because sometimes some things are really, really small. So thank you for that. Um, let's see. Here's our self-addressed stamped envelope. Let's put that over here. Let's see what else she's got here. Look at this. Look at this, uh, envelope here. Look at that. Look at that. Isn't that close? Like from, it looks like India. Some scene from an India, some scene. And then let's see what else she's got here. All kinds of collage stuff. I think this is for her collage. Yeah, collage fodder for D. Okay, so let me separate. Let me show the cards first, and then I'll show you the. Um, 
get some here. Hang on. Let me get some paper clips. I'll show you her art cards and then I'll separate out her collage fodder. All right. Mm -mm. All right. So let's put this together and this together. All right. So let's take her cards out of the little. She just has them in little um, parchment, um, vellum, vellum sleeves. So I'm going to take them out for a minute. Here's the backs. Okay. Whoops. I like to flip them all at the same time. Oh, thank you, Michelle. Thank you. Very sweet of you. Thank you. All right, here we go. I know, right? Isn't that a pretty envelope? All right, here we go. Look. <laughs> Look how adorable. They're little, like, little gnomes, little fairy gnomes. Look how sweet. And they're all, they have this texture. She used some texture paste. So let me show you one at a time. <laughs> I know, right? That it does. Look. How sweet. Let me click on some of the comments. <laughs> I know. Aren't they just so sweet? Oh, my gosh. Everybody's going, oh, they're so cute. <laughs> okay, here's the next one. They all have just a different little places of textures, like little, it's like a yellow brick road kind of thing. <laughs> I know, right? Look. Yes, they are little precious babies, aren't they, Elaine? Okay, and here's the other one. That gold, that it's like a gold texture paste. Is that a is that like a gold gesso, a gold texture paste? I'm not sure what kind of gold, but it's you know it's texture and it's gold. I know, right? So I'm gonna put them back in their little sleeves, and I'm sure it's because she has a texture paste on. She wants it. I mean, they're not. It's not even sticky or nothing, but. Uh, she's probably extra careful. So thank you so much. Thank you so much. Love them, Julia. Thank you. So let me put them in with their self-addressed stamped envelope. So Julia O'Hare Slayton. All right, let's keep those together. Where's my paper clip? And then separate from that is her collage fodder so i've not gone through this so let's see what she sent in the collage fodder and then the the um little card she sent to me this will go in the um fibs book all right so let's see so this was that all right <clears throat> all right let's see here some tissue papers not sure what they are of. Lots. Oh, so lots of little little stuff here. Okay, so here's a doily. Let's just go through this. Some just little cards. Some little, just different little faux ephemera. Here's a napkin with some music instruments. And just so much little stuff. Look, look at this little embroidered heart just all kinds of little stamps and faux ephemera little foil she must do a lot of collaging right bye Devin. thank you she must do a lot of the collaging right to have all, all this stuff little, little proverbs some paint chips a little piece of wallpaper another paint chip so she sent all this to make a collage out of. Oh, some, some uh, of those, um, those vein, you know, the leaves, um, the veins of the leaves. Oh, look at this bookmark. 
with the little um, kimono girl on here. And then just some little stamped papers. There's a little, like a faux photograph. Some stickers. Oh my gosh, she sent tons of stuff, didn't she? Some more stickers. <clears throat> oh, look at this little, little crocheted hot air balloon. Some more journaling spots. Some little... Uh, Scrapbook papers. Here's oh, God, oh my gosh. Look at the little little jewels. <laughs> so much fun. Little envelope. So much fun in a some braille. So much fun in an envelope. A cathedral. I like this. I know I will use this. I know I'll use that and I'll probably use this. Look at this. I love that too. And this, I love this. I love the medieval, medieval pictures. And then a little tag. Do more than exist, live. Do more than look, observe. Do more than read, absorb. Do more than listen, understand. Do more than think, ponder. Do more than talk, say something. That's good. Everybody needs to put that in your, uh, put this in your society of idea collector notebook. Isn't that awesome? Oh, that, Julie, is this you? Okay, Julie, I didn't know that that was you. Let me write your name on here. <laughs> See, y'all don't put your screen name. I don't know sometimes. Is that you, Julia? O-M-C-S. Okay, I'm going to put that on both things. Julia O-M-C-S. Okay, thank you, Julia. Okay, thank you. Oh, I'll, I'll pull her out then if that's for me. I'll take her. <laughs> I love her. Let me get the little... Okay, I'm going to leave that on there because it's got some sticky tape on there. Okay. Thank you, Julia. I didn't know that was you. Let me put this on your... Uh... All right. I try to keep y'all organized. I love her. Oh, thank you, Lady Jan, for the fish for the cats. I'm telling you, you should have seen them this weekend, uh, Lady Jan. <laughs> oh, I finally had to break down and give them one. <laughs> I love that. Thank you so much. No, you did you? Yep, yeah, she did put from Julia on the back. Thank you. Thank you from Julia. Oh, okay, thank you so much. I love it. Okay, so let me let me um put this, let me wrap this up. Hang on. Let's wrap this up in a this to keep it all together because I have um let's put a rubber band on this because I put um I put these separate from the art cards, the collage fodder. The collage fodder I'm putting separate over here from the, uh, let me wrap up my birthday cards. Some of these I can put in the Fibs book. Hang on. All right. Separate this out. All right, got it separate. Okay, so thank you so much. I think that's all of them. That's all the art cards and collage fodder. Now, I might have some down in my post office box right now, but uh, if Hubster doesn't check it today, I'll go tomorrow and um, to get all that uh, together. And, and I want to show during, you know, every, every stream. I want to try to show what y'all have um, sent in art cards. Okay, so if we don't get to this today, probably not because I still want to show what they don't teach you in art school book. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Tori. Let me write you down. Tori. Let's see. I gotta check on that. Is a thank you so much, Tori. Let me check click on there you go. 
Sorry, miss your birthday stream. Belated birthday wishes. Dee, crafty hugs all the way from Dublin. Thank you, Tori. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> and of course, I will send you out a print. You have been getting any happy mail, right? I think you said you're getting my happy mail fine. I think you said that. So, um, yeah. All right. And then this girl, I got to check on her Instagram. All right. I think we're good on all the cards. Thank you so much, Tori. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right. So uh, I showed earlier that Zandra sent me the um, the Crayola pencil color pencils and markers of the colors of the world. So I want I will probably do this on Wednesday. We're going to do a test. We'll test them out and do some shading and see what we can do with these. I'll probably get a color book page out, you know, a girl. Uh, or two girls, you know, just to do the, some skin tests. So we'll probably do a color book page on Wednesday testing these. All right. So the last thing I'm going to show today is this. And uh, again, thank you, everybody that's participated in the swap. And I will be putting links to Sister Woman Jonna's Vintage Paper Kits, Selena's Etsy shop for, if y'all missed it earlier, I showed another order I got from Selena um, for her um, uh, fabrics. And she did say that if you go on her Etsy, she did do another um, deal of the day for you guys here. And, uh, and I'll also put a link for the, the washi tape that Annie sent me. And I think that's all the links for the day. And uh, Will Terry, um, this was a Kickstarter book that he did. I followed Will Terry for years. He used to do, a, he used to have an online school and, um, and I still follow him on Facebook. So anyway, what they don't teach you in art school, an illustrator's guide to making money in the real world. Now, obviously I'm not going to show you every page, but I want you to, um, to enjoy some of this. I got some. You are an artist. You love to create. You want to be able to make money with your art. This book will help you make the changes necessary and give you the knowledge to earn a living with your art. He used to have a YouTube channel. It was very, it was very popular. Then he had, you know, some life issues and things going on. And I think he, I don't think he's doing YouTube videos anymore. I don't think. I haven't seen, seen any lately. Um, I know he did a couple when he was doing, uh, promoting this book, but I don't think he's doing them like, you know, like regularly. Okay. Um, oh, you're welcome. Thanks, G. Thank you. All right. Thank you, G. All right. So anyway, uh, he's a digital artist. This is some of his work. And you might, um, here's a book plate that you can put in the book, and I will probably do that. Um, you may recognize some of his little characters. He does, let me see if I can find something that's really um, stands out to me. So there's some other artists in the back here, but I want to find some of his little, he has these little, I don't know, they're little round-headed and little, like, you know, they're just uh, really, let's see. I'm trying to find some of his little characters that are real obviously his. And they have these big eyes. I'm pretty sure that's one of his. And he used to do, um, he used to do, uh, what do you call it? Uh, comic cons and, you know, that kind of stuff. And he had prints and... But he's an amazing artist, and he but he does it all digitally. And uh, I'm just going to kind of flip through. Here's one. This is a perfect example of one of his little characters. A little tin man. <laughs> I'll read you the table of contents here in a second. So, um, yeah. So whether you do digi or not, whether you do, you know, and I don't do much digi. Oh, here's another one. Here's this little Frankenstein. Uh, but, it, you know, you will learn so much from him. Um, okay, so let's see. Let me read the table of contents. <clears throat> okay. Why I wrote this book, how to be successful in art school, becoming a master artist, getting freelance work after art school, 
creating your own brand, getting a full-time art job, professional practices afterward. And then what is the biggest lesson you've learned as a working professional artist? And then notes in the back. So again, guys, and see right here, you can see from here on all this right here are other, oh, there you go. These are other artists here. So these are other artists that have examples in the book. So there's just so much. I haven't had a chance to read it yet. I just got it. And, uh, but I wanted to share it with you guys. And uh, so I'm not sure if he still has some available. You can contact Will Terry. I know he's on Facebook. And uh, I think he's on Instagram. I think he's still on Instagram. And to see if he still has any books available. But yeah, it's a nice big hardback book. I mean, it's, you know, very high quality book. And, uh, and it did come with this book plate and him signing it. So that will go in here. Thank you, Amber Nicole. Thank you so much for the super chat. Let me write you down. And guys, if I don't have your address, make sure you email me so I can put you on the thank you um, monthly thank you. Thank you so much, Amber. Happy birthday. You are an amazing artist and truly inspire many. So thank you. Thank you, Amber. Make sure you email me. Okay. I don't think I have your address. And uh, <coughs> I also want to repeat, I do not put you on a mailing list and I do not share your addresses with anybody, not even the other mods. So just FYI. I know. Thanks, Julie. Thank you, Julie. Um, so yeah, go you down. I write everybody down that super chats me and PayPal tips jar me. So if you PayPal tip jar me, it's the same thing. I do, um, I do, uh, send you out a monthly thank you along with the people that super chat, super sticker, super chat or PayPal tip jar. You all get a monthly thank you. So thank you so much. Thank you, Julie. Yes. Thank you. So, um, did anybody say, see what Janet's doing today? Janet streams at one. Here's somebody else's. I wanted to check. Where's my, oh, I took my phone out of here. I was going to say I want to check something on Instagram, but I took my phone out because the family was ding, 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 <laughs> messaging each other. Uh, so, okay. Well, y'all have any questions or comments on anything I've shown or you've seen today? We did cover a lot, magazines, books, art cards, collage fodder, um, pens, I mean, markers and pencils, books, uh, the art card, washi tape, um, fabrics, Selena's fabrics, John is Etsy. <laughs> we covered a lot. We did a lot of promoting everybody today, which I love. Um... Well, hope so too, Abigail. Let's make someone happy. Oh, okay. Well, hopefully they'll get here. You still have, a, you know, still up till the 24th. Plus that weekend, you know, if any come in that weekend, I just won't be able to show them. If, if they come after the 24th and I swap them out, you just won't get, you know, I won't probably have a chance to show them because uh, I'll be swapping them out to get them out. Um, I know, I know, right, CB? Thank you so much for participating, too. Um, I don't see Janet answering me as to what, Janet, woohoo, Janet. <laughs> you see, you, sometimes you step away when you're watching streams. I do. And I just wanted to know, unless someone saw what she's doing today, because I was busy showing everything. So let's see here. Let's back in at one here. Oh, thank you, Terry. Thanks so much. Thanks for participating. Thank you all for participating in the in the uh, art card swap, and and also in the um, collage fodder test. So the people that have sent in, you know, the, the first few, I said I'm going to do practice and see if I like doing them, and if you guys like the collages that I make. So right now I'm doing them for free, but I can't, you know, I can't do hundreds of collages for free. Just saying. <laughs> So I will have to, you know, charge y'all for that. Um, what I, you know, if if I, if I keep doing them. Um, the other thing is I am getting people asking me about the little uh, prayer pouches. What I decided to do with these guys as I make them is um, 
I'll let y'all, uh, if I make you one, and you can ask, you can request one. Again, I can't promise I can make hundreds of these either. So, but if you um, if you request one and I do make you one, don't send me any money until I actually tell you I'm mailing you one. But then I will let you just give me a donation for whatever you want or can afford if I make you a, a prayer pouch. So the prayer pouches will be by just whatever you want to send me. But again, it's going to have to be as I make them. Don't send me any money or anything like that until I actually make you one and send it out to you. OK, so that's what I'm going to do with the prayer pouches um, that I'm making um, and I am using. Um, the fabric from Selena at um, Am Amor Fabrique. I, and I'll put her link again in. She has a YouTube channel and an Etsy shop. I have been using her fabrics. And I, I have my own trims and laces. And I do uh, try to customize them all with a... Th this one's going to John, a sister woman. So I she has a little camper. So I did that one for her. Uh, hi, Deb. Thank you, Debbie. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the super chat. And I'm pretty sure I have your address, Debbie. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. And um, thank you. Happy birthday. And thank you for all the fun and inspiration. Well, thank you. Thank you for supporting the channel. I'm, I'm sitting here. I write everything down. I post it notes like, you know, piles. Thank you so much, Debbie, for supporting the channel. And thank you for the birthday gift. Thank you so much. Now, you can donate anything you want, but don't donate till I make one. Until I mail you one. When, when I get ready to mail you one, I'll tell you. Um, whoever, you know, you have to email me. If you want one, email me and tell me, you know, and I can't promise you what kind of charm you're going to get because uh, I it depends on what I can find, right? I can't make this a full-time, full-time, you know, making these a full-time job, right? Because I do have my uh, portrait people and pet portrait commissions plus my streams and all the stuff we do here. So I have to have a balance. I have to balance it. You're welcome, Carla. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you. All right. Well, I haven't seen Janet answer. Julie, did you see if Janet um, is going to do on our stream today at 1? I hope you all enjoyed this. We didn't get any really projects done, but I did get to share you guys' art and uh, different things that I got for my birthday, which I appreciate it all. You're welcome. All right, guys. Well, I will leave the links for Jonna, Selena, and the place where Annie sent me the washi tape. I'll leave those in the description box. Thank you again, guys, for the art card uh, participation and for the stamps and the extra um, postage money. I appreciate it. All right, guys. Well, y'all have a great day. We'll see you at Janet's. And I'll see you guys back here on Wednesday. Um, okay, so Julie says she's going to be doing the scavenger hunt or watercolor, she said. Okay. Don't forget, Janet has a scavenger hunt going on where if you find your hundred things that she has a list for, I think it's in her community tab, uh, you have until April 1st to finish her scavenger hunt, and then she'll be doing a, a random giveaway for anybody that participated and completed her scavenger hunt. All right, guys. Y'all have a blessed. Oh, there she is. There she is. Okay, Janet. All right, guys. We'll see you later. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.